G'day YouTube, this is just a quick video to show you how to install Chrome, the Chrome web browser, in Linux Mint 15. Now it's fairly easy to do, easier than you might think, and there are a few different ways to do it, like for example install it from the Linux Mint official repository, but you're not always necessarily getting the latest and greatest version from there. So what you really want to do is open up a terminal and go to Chrome, sorry not a terminal, a web browser and go to Chrome.com, like so, Chrome.com hit enter, let that load up for a half a moment, then you'll see download now. And the important thing here to note is the fact that uh, you're going to need a different type of uh, DB, .deb installer in order to actually install it, just based on your type of Linux Mint. Now you may have a 32-bit or a 64-bit, uh, if you know that's great, then select one or the other, but if you don't know I would suggest just stay with 32-bit. Also, you'll see four options, not two, and the top two are for Ubuntu, but of course this just means that uh, this is for Linux Mint, because Linux Mint is based off Ubuntu. So I'm going to go the 32-bit, I'm going to go accept and install, I'm going to go save the file, and then it's going to download the file slowly but surely, 18 seconds, 12 seconds, 654321. And once that's... Uh, Downloaded, I'll just quickly show you how to install. It's very easy. Just go to your open containing folder if you're in Firefox browser, if you're installing it or getting the file from Firefox. The downloads folder, navigate there, and then just, uh, here we go, here we go, Google Chrome Stable Current. So just right click on it or double click, left double click on it. Go to open with GW package installer. So it's that simple, really. Just uh, wait for that one to load up. Shouldn't take too long. It's just at this point uh, getting all the necessary dependencies, package files, dependencies in order to actually install it. And there we go. From that point, all you have to do is click install package. So throw in your password. And then that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, after it is installed, you'll find it in your applications menu, wherever you go there internet or uh, you may be running cinnamon so the applications menu might look a little bit different but yeah there you go pretty much in a nutshell guys um, let that one install it's just taking its time but that's pretty much it guys hope you've enjoyed uh, please leave a comment and uh, please subscribe thanks again for your time ciao